Hello, I'm Dina from Bina Nusantara University. I will present my paper about experience optimization, measuring mobile apps user experience using usability testing. This paper, the result of uh, my student thesis, uh, collaboration with me as lecturer and student. Paper tell about Cinemax brand official rebrand that it's named to Cinepolis on 4 December and mobile apps book service on the Cinepolis apps has an update user experience from the previous Cinemax application. Both from the file selection process to the payment process, even though the design has updated. There are many users who read with poor ratings. This assessment can be seen from the writing on two different operating systems, both Android and iOS, which make the average value of Android 3.2 out of 5. Then we can see uh, the fig and iOS 1.9 out of 5. This is a review from Google Play Store and a review from uh, App Store. This paper use method uh, adopt from Nielsen theory on usability testing, which is measured by five criteria, namely learnability, efficiency, memorability, errors, and satisfaction. With the research instrument is the distribution of questionnaire and also face-to-face -face interview with users who have used the application. The state of the research were divided into three parts, namely usability testing, testing and respondent profile, and questionnaire. Currently, the number of users who use the Sinopolis application through both Android and Apple devices is uh, 360. By using the Slovin formula, the error margin is 5%. Then the number of sample respondent needed is uh, 400 samples. The assignment scenario given uh, to our respondent are divided into five tasks. That is uh, one, creating or uh, registering a new idea. Uh, ID, I mean, two, login and profile settings, three, select the movie and payment, four, inbox and booking details, and five, log out and change password. Then, uh, tab tabulation from uh, the Excel uh, result of a questionnaire, uh, we know for the status, describe the success of respondent in completing the task, there are two values in steps. Value 1 illustrates that the task was completely successful, where this is unsuccessful will get a value of uh, 0. For the times, describe the time is, it takes the respondent to complete the task. The unit on uh, the unit of time in this table is second. And error describe the number of mistake uh, from the respondent. And for learnability, to measure learnability, we measure the level of success of the user in completing uh, the task from the result of the success rate calculation which reaches um, 100 and this is success rate for uh, learnability and efficiency we got uh, low uh, uh, time based efficiency result uh, obtained are just 0, 0.00 something that so that the level of speed of the user in finding the information needed in the application uh, very low per second and for errors we have uh, was uh, 1.7 so uh, the error rate is still is 
in a reasonable condition. And memorability, we have found the first uh, for the first step in the experience detect the effective rate uh, one uh, sorry zero point four seven five and for the second testing the effective rate uh, zero. From the result, it can be concluded that the application is very easy to remember how to use it. But how, what uh, and what about the satisfaction? For satisfaction, we use uh, SOS method. We got grade D with assessment score of um, 60, uh, 61. The score is included uh, in the not acceptability category. The data calculated from the SUS questionnaire illustrated the level of user satisfaction. So, based on data from the result of the questionnaire analysis, observation, and interview, the usability result on the Indonesian Sinopolis application get good result. What is lacking is the satisfaction category where the weakness of the Cineplus application itself are in the application features that are too simple and cannot provide satisfaction to uh, its users. So, the Cineplus application requires change our, or upgrade to the application where among them are added, uh, the addition of several new features and UI improvement. Here are some suggestions. One, adding the new feature uh, to applications such as uh, feature coming soon, FAQ and contact us features, continue as uh, guest feature, then a cinema location filter uh, feature, then adding payment option such as a virtual account, bank transfer, others uh, e-wallet. So, uh, from the result of the study, which consists of three states, uh, observation, usability testing, and questionnaire, so we can, uh, for, for one, the result of the rating that illustrated satisfaction in the Play Store and App Store saw a significant difference, namely uh, 3.2 and 1.9. Uh, Based on the comment, it was found that user satisfaction with the application against several features that are less effective and efficient. Two, after the usability testing was carried out by means of observation, the result of learnability, efficiency, error, and vulnerability were quite good. However, in testing using the system usability scale questionnaire, the satisfaction result were not good so the interview are conducted to be able to find out the variable that cause the application to be unsatisfactory. So, and the last, from the result of the interview, it is now that the application is too simple and does not have interesting feature. So, we got uh, some uh, feature for adding in the uh, as a recommendation for Cinemolis. I think thank you.